Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, Maslon32, you are back for another episode of Minecraft Story Mode. Now before I start, I am going to say a few things, probably only last bit a minute, but instead of doing my like 20 minute part episodes, or up to 40 minutes, I'm just going to play to the end of the episode for this, for the rest of this season. And in season two of Minecraft Story Mode, which I'm doing right after this, I will get up and once every time there's an episode stoppage, so like the, an episode's coming soon, I will upload Batman the Telltale series. So without further ado, let's go. Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Everything in the universe starts out as just a block. What comes of those blocks is up to those who wield them. And in every block, there lies the potential to create or destroy. Our friends have traveled far and wide in search of the Order of the Stone. And a way to stop the Wither Storm for good. But even well-laid plans can go awry. The strong can grow weak. And beloved heroes can fall. The threat to this world, to its very existence, is far from over. Who is Petra? We need to get out of here now. This way. Jesse, you made it. Uh, Petra? Your missing friend? Look out! Those Endermen are running the wrong way! They'll be killed! Soren? I can't stand by and watch! Stop staring and get a move on! Well, I can't just abandon them, not after a lifetime of study. Your head's gonna be abandoning your body if you don't turn around and run! <laughs> Jesse! They're falling behind! Axel, you gotta move faster! He's too sick. This is the best we can do. They're not going to be able to outrun it. Not on foot. We got to find a way to move faster. We're all going to be caught in the tractor beam. Can we build a portal? If somebody has the right materials. We don't. I haven't seen Obsidian since the end. We'll have to use the next best thing. Everybody, get on! We got this. We'll take the reins, 
and they can just hang on. I'll take Gabriel. Then I've got Petra. Hold on, this might be a bumpy ride. <laughs> God damn it, I just, I, um, I, the, uh, all that gameplay I was sitting talking, and I forgot I left my mic on mute. That was stupid. Kill Minecraft, Minecraft Peeper. Ah, don't do that. Axel, stop backseat steering. I can't help it, I'm getting horse sick. Splendid, yeah. Yeah. Chicken. Oh my god, it was a chicken raining a zombie. Pick up the pace or we're all done for. First time on a horse here. Watch out. Huh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ah! Ah! Excellent horsemanship, Jesse! Is that what this is called? <laughs> horsemanship. God damn it. Sorry. I'm confused at how you sand is staying up. Axel, you're screaming in my ear. Sorry. Minecraft sand falls. I'm, I'm really confused. Okay then. Uh, we made it. We actually freaking made it! Jesse, Petra was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. She was inside the wither. She might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way she's been acting. I'll go talk to her. Hey, how are you feeling? I don't really feel... Like myself? I still can't believe you're even alive. Do you not recognize us? I'm Axel. This is Olivia. The Witherstorm did something to her. So she doesn't remember anything? Not even me? Who can forget me? Oh, a lot of people that doesn't like her face. You, Jesse. You're the one who rescued me. Tell me, please, what is going on? All I remember was endless blackness. And then you were there. Up until a little while ago, we all thought that you were, you know. I thought I was too. All I know is I was so scared in there. I thought for sure I was dying. Well, you didn't. You made it back alive. We didn't all make it back, though. Oh, man. Magnus. For a second there, I almost forgot. No! Look at the... Five. Yeah. Order the soup members, oh, if you still can. Ivor is an order the soup member. Still can't believe it. Yeah, how, Elgar, what do we knew if I took your armor? this have happened? Lou's not just a friend. 
but a member of the Order of the Stone. All I know is he'd want us to keep fighting no matter what. And for us to keep blowing the crap out of stuff. <laughs> You're right. He would. Indeed. Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? My instructions were simple. You were the one in the middle of everything. What went wrong? The Formida bomb just wasn't strong enough. I mean, it ripped the Witherstorm apart, but it didn't make a dent in the command block. So the command block is still out there? Of course it is. Oh, great. And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one Witherstorm to three. Our plan was a total failure. I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Why didn't I destroy that cursed block ages ago? So is the command block controlling all three Witherstorms? Oh, why are you asking me? Am I expected to know every last thing in the universe? <sighs> I need a moment to think. Well, is it always like this? You have no idea. That jacket, it looks familiar. Lucas always wears that jacket. No, I saw other people wearing it when I was being thrown from that dead monster. Ugh. Even thinking about it hurts. Hey, hey, it's okay. Jesse, if what Petra said is true, I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but Lucas, your friends could still be out there. I know, and that means I, I gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. Ah. Uh. <gasps> the room, everything's spinning. It's okay. Easy does it. Let's talk to the hey, pig. buddy. You doing okay? Of course you are. Wish I could say the same for everyone else. Okay, talk to us. Talk to Lucas. Lucas, Lucas. Please don't go. No. Dirt? Don't think so. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you. I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. But if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. But I can't leave them alone out there. And what if Petra's wrong? In case you haven't noticed, she's not exactly firing on all cylinders at the moment. I've got to try, Jesse. Otherwise, I just couldn't live with myself. But Lucas... Look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. They do it for me. Same way you'd go back for any of your friends. But we are helping them. Saving the world saves them too. Isn't that just kind of abstract? No, no. The number one thing you can do for them is to make sure we defeat those wither storms. I I guess you got a point. Okay. I'll stay. I just I just really hope they're all right. Thanks. Yeah. I'll check on my horses. I swear to God, if you leave behind my back, Lucas, I will come. I will look for you. I will find you, and I will kill you. I'm fine. I said I'm fine. Yeah, and I'm a puffer fish. Okay then. Some leftover cobblestone might come in handy. Cool. Well, no, that probably will come in handy. Okay, one cobblestone would do crap. Petra, how are you doing? Are you remembering things yet? I... I don't know. These little flashes keep coming back to me, but then they float away again. We've been trying to talk to her, but... It's like she's never met us before. I know I've met you before. Before today, I mean. I just don't remember... how, exactly. I keep seeing a... dark alley? But then that turns into trees. We traded a wither skull together. Do you remember that? Didn't you... Didn't you screw that up, though? Hey, screwed up is a very strong term. No, no, you screwed something up. Big time. Yes, it's working. You're remembering Jesse. Do you remember me, too? No. <laughs> and yet, I feel like I know all of you, somehow. Maybe it's the way you're dressed. 
Something's ringing about. Nope, I'm not Lisa saying that. Was at Endercon with us. She helped you create a distraction so we could go after this diamond you were owed. I don't like it when people take advantage of my friends. Wait, didn't we all fight that wither thing together? Yes, we totally did. She remembers it. I remember running to a, a, a temple in the woods and we were going to be safe there. And how did I end up? Inside that thing. Um, well, oh. something bad happened there. Look, there were two of you caught in the tractor beam that day, and, well, I helped Gabriel. The sick guy over there. Oh, yeah, I think I do remember that. You gotta realize I thought we needed him. If it was just about who I liked. No, oh, I, I get it. You did what you had to do. All that matters is you're with us now. And that you're still a fighter. Best one I know. So, what do you say? Will you be part of our group again? All right. Count me in. Why do they like she's in shades? And that's one thing I realized since she gave it. Why does it look like she's in shades? Jesse. Hello. Just making the rounds. You feeling any better, Gabriel? The battle with the wither storm sapped the last of my strength. Considerable the it was. You need to rest. You done nothing but build against the wither storm. Look, Jesse, wherever you decide to go after this cave, give him some time to get his strength back. The problem is we don't have time. Jesse's right. In fact, it might be best if my journey ends here. This cave is safe, easy to defend. It's relatively comfortable. I might even find a shred of peace. If that's what you feel is best, then I support it. You've been through too much as it is. Thank you, Jesse. I'm just sorry that I can't be there for you. Me too. <sighs> I thought that meant keeping her in the Nothing cave, no. Turn out like this. Leaving them, damn it. If the order had just been different. If we'd made smarter choices, Ivor wouldn't have turned into a maniac and, well, maybe Magnus would still be alive. Let's just let bygones be bygones. But how can we not? So many lives torn asunder, the world ripped to pieces. We've all made mistakes, including Ivor, right? Well, nothing's quite that simple. <laughs> but I appreciate you saying that. All this talk of the past has me exhausted. You need to rest. Will he be okay? I honestly don't know. Just get back out there and kick some butt for the both of us. <laughs> Ugh, a pig? Oh, no. Ruben! Oh, not again. Am I glad you came along? Just don't tell Ruben I said that. He might get jealous. <laughs> How are the horses looking? Tired, but they're okay. Same as the rest of us. Well, I'm glad you're staying with us, Lucas. Yeah, me too. You're not so glad. Okay, go to bed. Go to bed. Holy crap. There, it's Ruben. Don't run off on me like that, okay? Oh, she's pretty snow. Petra didn't mean it, Ruben. She's just not herself right now. Yeah, I know. I, I wish she would get better, too. The world needs us, Reuben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock, and it's up to us to save the rest of it. Well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig, but... Okay, when the hell did Jesse learn how to study oink? Okay, what?
There are three of those things now. You say that like it's my fault. It is your fault. Oh, take responsibility for what? I thought. You son of a bitch. Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? Would you both stop arguing, please? Oh, no, this isn't an argument. It's me trying to make Ivor leave us alone. I told you, I wouldn't have followed you here without good reason. What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No, I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. Oh, well. You hmm. mean the Order's amulet? Yes, Soren. That amulet. Oh, don't be so dramatic. Did you also know I was the one he gave the amulet to? What? I... I didn't know. Ah, oh, Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Wrong. Except Enderman. Yeah. Enderman? Jesse's right. The Wither's gaze passed over them, and they went wild. We actually just saw a bunch of Endermen pull blocks off a Witherstorm. So... So, enough of them working together might be able to destroy a wither storm entirely. It's a promising concept, at least in theory. But to actually destroy a wither storm, we'd need hundreds of them. There's probably more than enough of them taking refuge in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days. Story. I did not flood the end. I flood. I flooded the hallways and your little world of your imagination. But they don't follow orders. At least, not from mere mortals. We know for a fact the Witherstorm will follow the amulet. So if we take the amulet back to your fortress where the Endermen are, yes, yes, that's it. We'll lead them straight into a massive trap! If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block! Ugh, oh, yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a Formidabomb. Actually, I oh, damn it. may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, just in case. Well, I'd say just in case is here. What kind of failsafe exactly? An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon, and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever. Yes. Yes, that's it. It could very well solve all our problems. What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book. Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? Uh-oh. so quickly we're not safe anywhere are we well we can't stand around and wait for it guys there's a reason it's been following us Ivor says it's because of the amulet that Gabriel Ivor well I'll be it is you a pleasure as always Eligard don't tell me these two had a relationship I thought it was my thing so we're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon you figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. There's no way I can let you do that, Axel. 
You don't understand. I'm not asking. Oh, okay then. Why don't you trust me by now? I do trust you. It's not that I don't want you to. That super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, I want to go with Jesse. That feels like where I belong. Me too. But what do we do about Gabriel? The rest of you go. I'll take care of Gabriel. Are you certain? Yes, I owe him that much at least. Besides, I'm not going anywhere with Ivor. My friends are still out there somewhere. And you must do this for them. Well, never thought I'd be saying this, but Ivor, lead the way. Hey, Jesse. Let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. Oh, God. The warrior's whip? You got it. <laughs> I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first. Does that make a difference? I don't know. No, the fact that this is only the freaking credits and I feel about 20 minutes in, I don't know if I'll split this up to like a half hour episodes. How long has it been? Because 25 minutes, so roughly about 30 minutes this has been. Oh, that's getting annoying. There yet? Almost there. Almost. If this goes fast, a couple more day, day, daylight things. Are we there yet? <laughs> Everyone's enjoying that. Really not necessary. Oh, okay. Just trying to be encouraging. Okay, it comes again really now over there. You get to send my R for I for. Wait a minute. Okay, the 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 ice statues are really really insensitive. Look at them. <laughs> Are we there yet? Oh, we're into the moss. No, we're just into the oak. Just into our jungle. Forest. Jungle. No, we're driven. There's no longer enjoying yourself. We are not there yet. Hey, take off Ivor. My butt's never been so sore in my life. Not that I remember. Huh. I feel like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Perlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. Why are you so down on the Far Lands, Soren? They sound cool. See? Jesse thinks the Far Lands are cool. The far lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? You asking me? All I can think about is food. Yeah, I'm starving. We all are. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. 
Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. Who was that? My stomach. Let's look around, see what we could find out. Yeah, don't worry. The far lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? Oh god. Okay, well, you want piece of food from a cell. Right. Okay, so the potatoes. Okay. Eat and take. Okay, so eat. Potatoes. Okay, why did you say potatoes like he was eating it before he actually ate it? Ate it. And take that. Potatoes you're coming with me. Not much, but it'll help. Hey Jesse, have you found any food? Yeah, oh we have a cake. Group. Nope, nope, we're not taking what I have. There's a cake in there. Witches happens when witches are involved. Look, a cake! That's that's enough to feed everyone. It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate tra There are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? <laughs> Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. Ivor, I can't pass this up. I need you to watch my back, okay? I'm telling you, this is a bad idea. Keep watch. Just be quick about it. Come on, no, no, I'm just taking the cake. An entire cake. Nice. Jesse. <laughs> yes. Jesse, help us! Hey, you, witch! <laughs> Everyone, let's get out of here ASAP! Ivor said the Far Lands are just past the swamp. Wait, where is Ivor? What? I thought he was with you. I don't know. He disappeared outside the witch's hut. Curse that fool of a man. Come on! You guys can see that, but okay. Guys, I think we lost them for... Wow! I see your wow and raise you a... It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. Oh, that is so creepy. Glad Jesse snagged this cake. Makes the whole wall of insanity thing a lot easier to face. Hmm. I think I like cake. Who doesn't like cake? By the sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory. This wall? Did Ivor build this? No, of course not. This is a natural phenomenon. The intersection of two of the great walls that form the boundary of our world. Feeling kinda overwhelmed right now. How can Ivor live here? I mean, it's one thing to build a wall world inside the end, but this. Oh, I doubt he lives here. He most likely comes here only for his most secretive research. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded.
This way, I suspect. I wish Axel was here. He'd just make some joke and we'd all feel better about this. I know what you mean. Come on! I am just imagine how long this thing's gonna take to render this the video. Cause we're only like we're not even halfway through the episode, a maze? and it's almost like forty minutes. Would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. So, maybe we should not just wander into the world's hardest maze without a guide. Fortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or I don't know. We followed Ivor to the far land. So, we'll keep going. Exit the shrine of charge. Into another dungeon of doom. I'm wondering how long this episode will actually be. Oh wait, I'm actually going to save the mace. Oh, I remember the gameplay and I was on top of the mace. I think that was when I was saying, let's explore the other way. Other ways, alright. Can't talk to anyone, okay. So I'm gonna go ways. Well then. Whoa. That is one of the coolest things I have ever seen. Far lands may be perilous, but they are indisputably fascinating. We should probably keep moving. Guys, looks like this is a... Oh no, Jesse! <gasps> There's too many! We can't fight them all! Everyone, back! Have you got... Is, is Petra holding a gold sword or a... Oh, I don't even know. God damn it. So, either way, we're going on top. Okay. Guys, climb the vines! <laughs> well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, but now what? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. Or you stick to stay there. there. Hey, that must be Ivor's lab. Wish it was a little closer. No. <laughs> Could keep walking to the left. Yeah, any point I look at a broken wall. No. Ah, end. Yep, end. Okay. That looks kind of a dead end. Yep. Okay. Let's go this way. Oh, I did not like that spider. Uh. Oh, that's the end this way. Nyong. Yikes! God damn it. Get that. Back off me. Uh oh. Got to be kidding me. At the worst time to possibly break. Keep going this way. You have got to be in it.
Olivia. <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. Olivia, have done my look. All right, I got rid of the cake. Sword broke. Ah, right, it makes sense. I do have the other potato. Okay, this is it, maybe the end. Huh. What's that? This one moving forward, isn't it? Sorry. <sighs> huh. Redstone blocks, some pistons. I wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse! There you are. I thought I'd never find you. Am I glad to see you guys? Us too. I thought Reuben and I would be lost in here forever. <coughs> this maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Yet we're lost in some elaborate puzzle. Well, we've got to push on to Ivor's lab somehow. Too bad there's a gaping bottomless pit in the way. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side. But it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. No, 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 no. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. Come on, you'll figure it out. You know you always do. <sighs> Fine. I'll take a look. This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. So prove her wrong. Show the world what you're made of. Prove her wrong? Jesse, she's the greatest redstone engineer ever. She's in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like us. Right, just like us. I mean... How are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. Because <laughs> it's not right. Well, with her sickness? None of them give Eligard any respect. And Magnus lost his life trying to fight this. Oh, my jaw just cracked. I don't like that. My jaw just cracked even. The order can't do this. How are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? Together. We're nobody. Damn it. You know what? We're better than them. Better than the Order? I don't know about that. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean Go keep up back, Marina. I'm Marina. I'm Marina. Starters, we're the ones who brought them back together again. You and I found Eligard together. We both played a role with Soren. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Ah, all right. I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston. Craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge. Okay, you make a sticky piston by just putting a stuff. You got all that? Piston. I think so. And a slime ball on top. So, chest, please be a slime ball. Looks like 
Ivor kept some redstone dust handy. And a slime ball. Oh, coincidence. Coincidence? I think not. Oh. The sooner the better. But uh, you have that fucking minute. I'm feeling the fucking. There we go. Snacking piston. Oh, then you have some luck. Okay, a redstone block. No, it's a diamond block. Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. Flint and steel to get it started. Nah, I'm so I'm proud that. of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. <laughs> this way, this way. Run. <laughs> hey, over here. Quick, onto the barge. They're still getting chased by zombies. No time to look behind you. Jesse? Uh -huh. That was close. Everyone okay? For the moment. Slime! Come again? I'm remembering something with slime. And ch chickens. Or maybe they were ducks? Yes, at Endercon. So Endercon is... A uh, chicken convention? Uh, no. I would love to go to a chicken convention. Wait, Ugh, it's already fading. Fading and gone. Take my advice, Petra. Some stories are better left forgotten. Ooh, what are you trying to forget? I'm curious now. Tell me. Amazing. I'm just oh God! You thought that was funny. Let's go see. What <laughs> okay. Roasts. Roast with Lucas. How can one person be? We should be careful. This place could be good. So just start looking for the enchanting book. Yeah, I doubt it's going to be any of these bookshelves like uh, when we were sitting. Are you just having any luck? No. Just, I've been thinking about other stuff, actually. Stuff such as... I mean, it's leaving my friend. Gabriel. No. Yasa, oh, that's there we go. People getting wither sickness and amnesia. Don't get me wrong. I'm glad I came with you. I just, I'm just scared for everyone. For them, for us. You're a good friend, Lucas. That's so the only thing I'm really gonna do is if it says take or examine, or um, or talk. Ivor, on the other hand. I think his only friends were books. <laughs> I guess being an angry loner leaves you a lot of time to read. <laughs> Tell me about it. How to train your slime, what? various uses of mushroom stew, potionology volume 24? Are any of them the enchanting book? I don't think so. Olivia, any luck? Not really. Ivor has too many books, and there's too few of us looking. How did we end up all split up like this? I feel like we're spreading ourselves too thin. I miss how things used to be. 
Look, we might be spread thin, but we're all still a team. That's how teams work. Hey, you almost said teamwork. See, we're still funny. We can still get things done. I guess being split up just means we can be in more places at once, right? Kinda like the wither storm. Let's just forget that metaphor. <laughs> Find anything yet? Huh, in this mess? Uh, it's as though Ivor learned nothing from my lectures on organizational methodology. I don't even know what that means, so no shit. Lost in that confounded swamp. He could just tell us where the book is. Coming here was his idea. He was just doing what I asked. It wasn't his fault we got separated, not really. Is that supposed to make me feel better? There's neither rhyme nor reason to how these books are stored. Finding anything here is impossible. <laughs> Tedious, maybe. Impossible? No way. Fine, I will continue this monotonous search. But I reserve my right to grumble about it. It's a deal. <laughs> cool. Ruben? Ruben, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, well, you're gonna get yourself cooked. I've told you before, stay away from lava. Lava? Lava is fire. No, it's lava. <laughs> cool. Hey, oh. Oh, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. Too bad I don't have one. Yeah, no lever, no functioning circuit. I do have cobblestone. I just need a stick. Hmm. Watch this. I'll get a stick with this. Wood planks. Ah, uh, no, I hate this. Coincidental. First, I'll need some sticks. Okay, why did they pull out sticks? But then I need to craft sticks. Logic was not made okay, to stay. Sticks. So what is a lever? Is it cobblestone in the bottom and sticks on top? Yeah. There we go. Good old fashioned lever. Lever, lever. Like it was made for it, which it was. No crap. Let's see what this sucker does. That's cool. Hey, there's a button. I want to push it. Push the button. Secret passageway. Cool. Okay, keep it try with that. <laughs> nobody ever visits. More like, why wouldn't you? Secret passageways are cool. Good point. <laughs> Good point. Uh oh. What the? Are you guys okay? We're fine, but the lever isn't working anymore. Stay there. We'll head down and see what we can find. Okay, you just keep searching on the books. Okay. Whoa. What is all this? Huh. Incredible. He's gathered them all in one place. Gathered what exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone! Huh. Okay. Stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there? Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. Hmm, okay, well, whatever it is, I'm taking all these stuff. Don't mind if you do. These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Eligard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool, rare item. 
We might need it to unlock that door. Mm, very well. Just be careful with it. Oh, one second. See? That's pretty, that's sea lion urn. So where'd this packed ice come from? Yeah, it would do me for now. The ice plane spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. So that was right before the Ender Dragon. Cold, cold and slippery. These gas tears, they're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. Just gotta borrow this. <laughs> sea lantern. Am I crazy, or is this a sea lantern? Ah, the very same one the Order built all those years ago. We were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. A sea lantern, huh? Okay, and the dragon egg. Sorry, is this the actual Ender Dragon egg? Huh, alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind. Whoa. Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Hmm. There's five things. Five over. Let me the order. Hmm. Five the slots. Okay, so the gas tiers go in one. Tiers. Let's try them here. The Ender Dragon egg goes at five. Dragon egg, so cool. Let's try it here. Um the pack ties here. Let's put it here. I do need a sea lantern before sea you can make. In you go. The egg before you can get the prismarine suit. So. Yep. Yep. Yes. There we go. You solved it. But how in the world did you know what order to put them in? There were 120 possible combinations. Everything I needed was in your stories. Nice work, Jesse. You know I often give Ivor a hard time, but. For all his complaining, his time with the Order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. Okay. By the stars, the Ender Dragon. With replica Ender Crystals and all. Wow, I always wondered what it looked like. Hmm, no way out. Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the- Alright, one second. Then I'm just popping on this year to see if I you guys. I'm sorry I cut off. I just have to cut down the time.